another E4. Go for the accelerated. I like to play the sniper move order. After CD4, Queen D4 hits the rook. Aha! But now this is tricky. I think the sharpest is to play maybe like this. Mm-hmm. Okay, gotta take this pawn. Ooh. Is it too much to play Queen A5 check? Try and mucky up the works? Well, I think we can give it a shot. This is too risky. Oh, got to be careful. Hold on. Hold on. No, 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 no. On bishop d2, I take it, of course. And otherwise, I can take, and I think I'm bailing out. Check. With can we win a pawn? It's a pretty valuable pawn. And I don't think he can fork us, because we bail out with knight takes d3 check. I think it's pretty okay. Anyway, like I was check. saying, I think we can bail out with check. And now, uh, let's go ahead and run for the hills here. Where do we want to go? Let's offer a queen trade. Why not? After all, aren't we a pawn ahead? And have the bishops. Okay, he didn't want to trade. Don't blame him. Now let's just get developed. Okay, could steal another pawn, but think not. Let's just get castled. Call it a day. Okay, gotta watch out here. But let's go attack that. Now I don't have to worry about bishop h6, and I think uh, we're we're on the way here. Do we want d5 or d6? Let's go for d6. Now we're ready with bishop g4. Okay, I think we're going to have to take that. Just useful to get out of the way. Okay, he's attacking our thing here. Let's go queen here. I guess queen a5 hitting c3 was good too. But... Okay. Uh, it's just nothing fancy here. Let's just develop. Okay, I think that. Oh, a little tricky there because if I trade and go here, then he has knight to g5. But not to worry. Let's just continue developing. And it should all be good. Okay, he's coming in here. I guess I could have played a little more aggressively here. Whoa, 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 whoa. Easy there, tiger. Look, where's he going? Let's just develop our rooks. Okay, gotta be careful there. Well, this bishop controls that knight, but okay, where is he going? Can we go here? Yeah, I think he's getting ready to play knight e6 pretty soon. Knight e5. Okay, actually knight e5 is even better now, I think, because he goes rook b4. Oh, well, don't really want to take that one. Ah, rats. Rats. What are we going to do here? Not, not thrilled with that, but let's see. Start getting rid of some of this wood here. Not necessarily doing this the best, but now yeah, I think we're getting back on target here. Let's just send this guy packing. Okay. Might have been something a little better, but well, let's just do this. 
King side's a little loose here. Okay, not doing this great, but I think we, we will get it done. Maybe Queen F4. Yeah, Queen F4 was, was a good way to go. And now he's making trouble. Now if I play Rook C4, he's got this Knight Knight here. I've really managed to monkey this up, but no worries, no worries, no worries. Just relax. Relax, Daddy. Not do anything stupid. Okay, for sure. Fired that one in there. Okay, let's just chill out. He is getting a lot of bits over here by my king, so. Okay. Where's he going? Let's start moving in the center. I gotta watch the clock here. Okay, now we got. Let, let's try and break this bad boy open. He goes rook f3, I got bishop d5 waiting for him. That should calm me down a bit. Okay. Time warning. Time warning, but position warning. I'm tempted to play e4 there. I guess e4 was good. Okay, what's he trying to do here? I think we're going to get to his king before he gets to me over here. Check. Okay, I think we got him. Check. Checkmate. Okay. Incoming challenge. So. Hey, we got black. Knight c3. Can we get a Jinji Indian? Yes. Yeah, of course, that doesn't mean we win the game, but. Ooh, f3. What are we supposed to do on f3? Okay, we can play here. Okay. Go ahead and play d6. Okay, so I doubled my pawns. I mean, I kind of like these positions for black, to tell you the truth. Someone actually even played queen here, but I think we can just castle, put our knight in on e5. Let's go ahead and do this. We got a nice square here on e5. Let's go ahead and put pressure on his pawn there. In a way, kind of hate to... Hmm. Now that's interesting. Okay, let's do it this way. Play here. Chill out here. Although, now that pawn on a5 is kind of extended, but I think here we're going to win a pawn, maybe. Got high hopes. This is protected. e4 is attacked twice. And knight e3. Although... <laughs> Hate to give up that knight for one of his silly rooks, but do what you got to do to get on with the show. So white's got problems here. And this is why I like the Jinji Indian, because an 18 moves with black and a Nimzo or a Queen's Indian probably never get this position. Okay, now we got a pawn. Now let's go ahead and play f5. Rooks need open files. I don't see any attack. The pawn on a5 is extended. He trades, we're going to take with a bishop. We've got two open files for our bits, and uh, I think it's all good. He may play rook e1 here. Actually, on rook e1, can we just exchange? Can we take that? Okay. Can we play queen e2 and start trying to uh, make some noise? 
Is that good? No tricks on the back rank? No funny business? I think we're good here. Hitting F2, F1, C4. Okay, I think we can uh, help ourselves here, right? He's kind of falling apart here. It happens sometimes in this opening. Not a lot to play for here besides the clock. D5 is hanging, C3 is hanging, already got an extra pawn in the pocket. And I don't really see where he's got the, any kind of kingside attack, so... Barring some kind of silly blade White on our part. Signs. Okay. That worked out pretty well. Again, Gingy Indian. Strong opening if they don't know what to do.